Hi, Julia. Hi. No, I haven't read the newspapers yet. Why? There's an emergency? All right, I'll read it right now. I need to read the newspaper. There's an emergency. Oh, God. I can't see. Where are my glasses? I need my glasses to read the newspaper. Where? Where are they? Hi, Miss Anjana. Oh, um, are you looking for something? I'm, hi, Sean. I'm looking for my glasses. Oh, Did you your, see them anywhere? Your glasses? Why, why, why do you yeah, need it for? I need, need it to read my newspaper. Oh, okay. There's an emergency in the There's town. There's an emergency! I need to read the newspaper. Oh, no. It's not... Oh, no. I, where I can know, it where, be? I don't know. TV KPM. Hello everyone, you are now watching Level 2 on Didate TV KPM together with me, Sean Steven, as your host. Now, earlier we saw that Miss Anjana was looking for her glasses, right? Huh, what can the topic of the day be? Hmm, but before that, how about we look at the teacher's profile for today? And of course, for today, we have our lovely teacher, Miss Anjana from SK Puchong Utama 2 uh, for today's lesson. Hi, hi. how are hi. you today? Hi, Sean. How are you? Oh, I'm great and I'm ready to start the lesson today. Um, the topic of the day is actually, of course, English. Newspaper article, it's an emergency. Is that correct? Yes, it is. Yes. So, we'll be looking into a very interesting topic today, which is, it's an emergency. So, shall we start? Yes, but I believe we also have some friends who are joining us for our lesson today, right? Yes, of course. All right, let's okay, take a let look at who they are. Let me introduce you to them. All right. Okay, so we have Chloe there. Hi, Chloe. Hi, Audrey. Hi, and, nice to meet you all. Hi. And we have Jayshan. Hi. And we have Adam. Hi. Hi, hi, everyone. And I believe they are from two different schools, right? Yes, they are. Okay. And uh, they are from SJKC, Chihua, Kolombong, Sabah. And those are, of course, uh, Chloe as well as Audrey. And we also have Jay Shant as well as Adam. And they are from SK Puchong Utama too. Is that correct? Yes, it is. All right. Wonderful. So what are we actually learning today? Okay. So are you, are you all ready? For the lesson today? Great. Okay, let's yes. look into our lesson today. Okay, today we'll be looking into the lesson, newspaper article, it's an emergency. All right. Before that, the objectives. By the end of the lesson, First, you have to read the text, answer the questions based on the text read, mm -hmm. and lastly, build words from the alphabets given. Shall we start now? All right, sure. And I believe everyone at home should be ready for this lesson. Are you ready? Give me a thumbs up if you are. All right, also we're going to give some time to our friends at home also to prepare their pen and paper as well. That's yes, right. they also have their mini whiteboards. Mm -hmm. Do you have your mini white whiteboards with you all? Yes. Great. Okay. All right, so it looks like everyone is ready. But for those of you who are at home, you can get your mini whiteboards ready as well, your pen and paper, because we're going to take a short break and we'll be back to you for Level 2 on the TV KPM.
Ide TV KPM. You are now watching level two on Didi TV KPM together with me, Sean Steven, and also our teacher for today, Miss Anjana, for obviously English. And the topic is newspaper article. It's an emergency. It's an emergency. All right, let's begin. Okay, now the first segment: read and solve it. Let's look at this. Okay, so this is a newspaper article. As you can see here, okay, we have the headline. Okay, uh, and Sean, what yeah. do you can you read for me the headline? Okay, I'll try. Uh, power cut hits millions. No light, no fan. Oh no. Okay, and who do you think the reporter is? Um, from what I can see over here, it's by Dinesh Nadarajan. Yes, it is. Okay, can we have Chloe? Are you there? Hi, Chloe. Chloe, can you look at no. the first paragraph? Can you read for me the first paragraph, please? Okay. A power cut hit Selangor State yesterday evening. Millions of people had no electricity for almost 16 hours. The power cut hit at 5 p.m. while year six pupils at SK Puchong Utama 2 were rehearsing for a school choir Quiet. performance. I was singing when suddenly all the lights went out, said 12-year-old Nurul Hidayah. Thank you, Chloe. So, uh, if, as you can see here, how long was the duration for the power cut? How long was it? Who can guess? Who can guess? 16 oh. hours. Sorry, who was that? Was yes, it, uh... Jishan? 16 hours. Excellent. 16 hours. Millions of people had no electricity for almost 16 hours. Okay, let's look at the second paragraph. All Can right. I have a... But before that, I think because Jay Shan answered correctly, right? does he get any rewards? Of course. So how many stars shall we give him? Hmm. One, two, three. He gets let's give him three, three stars. Three stars. <sighs> Yeah, well done. <laughs> okay, let's go on to the next paragraph. Okay. Can I have a volunteer? Yes, Adam. Thank you. Could you please read the second paragraph? Maybe we can go okay. to, over to the uh, next slide because I think I find the words a bit too small. Okay, I'll just yeah. move on to the next slide. Okay, sure. Because I'm afraid my friends at home won't be able to see. Ah, okay. So this is slightly this bigger. This is clearer. Okay. Okay, Adam. Across Selangor State, people were busy making dinner. I was cooking chicken curry for my family when the power went off. It was pitch dark everywhere. My stove, for, my stove is electric, so it stopped working. Unfortunately, we have to eat bread with butter for dinner. It, it, and it was really hot because we couldn't even use the fan or air conditioner, complained Puan Ramla in class. Poor Puan oh. Ramla. Okay, she had to eat bread and butter. Oh. Okay, thank you, Ada. Shall we move on to the next paragraph? Can I have probably uh, Audrey? Yes, teacher. Okay, can you please read for me the third paragraph? <laughs> Ambulance and hospital were busy through the night. The traffic lights stopped working, so there were some bad accidents, said Chamal, who drives an ambulance. At the National Zoo, a giraffe escaped and walked down the street. The zookeepers managed to get it safely back in the zoo, said Lim, who's in the zoo. And oh my, a giraffe escaped, Sean. Wow, that sounds like something you would see in the movies. Okay. <laughs> Let me ask you a question, Sean. Okay. Why do you think there was a power cut? What is the reason for it? Any reason guesses? For a power cut? Maybe one of my friends who are online can guess what the answer is? The pupils out there? Yes, we have Chloe to save my day. Yes, Chloe. A monkey jumped on the power lines and they stopped working. Yes, you are right. Why was there a power cut across a large part of Selangor? The answer is a monkey, Sean. Oh. We are embarrassed. A monkey jumped 
on the power lines and they stopped working. It was an accident. And Mr. Steven, the head of TNB, was very sorry for what had happened. Oh, okay. oh well. <laughs> now, since you have read the text, mm -hmm. let's look at a few questions. Okay, let's see if you can answer the question. Okay. Okay, we'll start with the first one. Uh, perhaps Sean can help uh, help them with the first one. Okay, I'll try. Who do you think said this? Remember the dialogues in the text. Mm -hmm. At the National Zoo, a giraffe escaped and walked down the street. Okay. The zookeepers managed to get it safely back to the zoo. And Sean... And the rest of you, you can also think. And the pupils out there watching this, guess the answer. And I think it is a zookeeper. And uh, Jay Sean, you actually raise your hand. Do you agree with Sean? Yes. Yes, it is a zookeeper. Yeah. So I think Sean <laughs> and Jay Sean both deserve three Stars. Three stars for both of Yay. us. Yes. Well done. We're the three star group. <laughs> All right. Okay. Let's move on to the second question. Okay. Who said this? Any volunteers? Um. So Sean, who who shall we call? Okay, I've I've heard a lot of Chloe uh, and Audrey. So maybe we can get uh, Ad, uh, Adam to uh, give us the answer this time. Okay. Don't worry, you have chances later. Okay, Adam. Adam this time. A student. A student said that? I was singing when suddenly all the lights went out. Let's yes. see the answers. Yes, it is. A pupil. Ah, well done. So, shall we give him three stars? Mm, okay, yes, congratulations. You get three stars. Excellent, Adam. Okay, we move on to the next one. Okay, this time, how many hours did the power cut continue for? Uh, shall we pick uh, probably Audrey? Okay, yes, yes, Audrey? we should. The power cut continued for 16 hours. Very good, excellent answer. <laughs> You have given the full answer and that is the correct way to answer a reading comprehension question. Ah. How many hours did the power cut continue for? Mm -hmm. The power cut continued for 16 hours. Three ah. stars for Audrey. Three stars for you. Hey, hey. Very good, Audrey. And Thank the you. next one. Most welcome. Why was there a power cut? All right, Chloe is the first okay. one to raise her hand. So, shall we uh, call up Chloe? Yeah. A monkey jumped on the power lines and they stopped working. Very good. And that's exactly how you should answer a reading comprehension question in a full form. Okay. There was a power cut because a monkey jumped on the power lines and they stopped working. Excellent. And I have one bonus question. Okay. Okay, and who's going to answer this question? I'm not going to show you the question. Now, volunteers first. Hmm. Any volunteer? So, can we choose Adam since okay. he's the since only the one? Only one, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Who is the reporter of the emergency article? Adam? Hmm. Dinesh Nadarian. Again, Adam? Dinesh? Dinesh Nadarian. Okay, good try. It is actually Dinesh Nadarajan. And, ah. and mm -hmm. um, good try, but you have to answer in a full sentence. The full sentence would be Dinesh Nadarajan is the reporter of the emergency article. All right. All right. Full okay. form, right? Full form. You okay. need to answer in a full form. All right? All right. So how many stars does he get for this? I think Adam gets two stars for this. Two stars, Adam. Good try, Adam. Well done. Two stars is still better than one. <laughs> yes, it is. Well done to you. Okay. Now, so we have done with all the questions. Again, mm -hmm. we look back at the... 
at the article. Okay. Okay, I just want you to look at the article. Mm -hmm. A newspaper article. Okay, if you look at the newspaper article, yes. there will be a headline there. The mm -hmm. headline is Power Cut Hits Millions, No Light, No Fan. And if you notice, there will be a the date there, which is 21st March 20, 2000 and, 2022. And then we have the reporter's name here. Okay, you have to always look at a newspaper uh, at the at the headline and as well as the reporter. Okay, is that clear? All right. Yes. Okay. And uh, looks like, Sean, we have come to the end of this session. All right, that's really, really good. And I guess everyone have already understood what we've learned so far. And hopefully those of you at home who are watching also understood what uh, Miss Anjana has already taught you. And what we're going to do right now, we're going to take a short break and back to you for Level 2 on Didit TV KPM. <laughs> KPM. And we are back for level two on DDA TV KPM together with Miss Anjana. And of course, the topic or the subject for today is English. The topic being newspaper article. It's an emergency. Let's continue, shall we? Yes, we shall. Okay, let's look at the next segment, which is let's be a grammarian. Oh, okay. Do you like grammar? Uh, yes, when I can do it well. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's look at this segment now. Are you all ready? Are you all ready? Okay, wait. I think I need yes. more than that. I need more energy. I want you to scream. Are you ready? Yes! There we go. Yes. Okay. They are really ready. Let's begin. Okay, let's look at this. Okay. Let's look at this sentence. Mm -hmm. Ali was watching television when his mother called him. I repeat. Ali was watching television when his mother called him. Now, Adam, can we have Adam first? Adam, what tense do you think this is? Was watching? Past tense. Past tense? What, uh, do you think it is past tense? Yes. Good try, but let's look at the... at the tense used there. It is past continuous tense. But it's a good try, Adam. Okay, and what about this? Called. Maybe, can we have uh, probably Audrey? Audrey? Simple past tense. Simple past tense. Okay, very good, Audrey. It is simple past tense. Okay, now, what is past continuous tense? Past continuous tense describes past event which was continuing at some point in time in the past, which means that event was happening when another event occurred, which is past continuous tense. And let's look at what is simple past tense. Simple past tense describes past event that happened in the past. So, if you look at this sentence, Ali was watching television when his mother called him. Was watching is past continuous tense because the event was continuing until his mother called him. Both of these actions happened in the past. Okay, now let's look at this second sentence. She was cooking dinner when the lights went off. I repeat, she was cooking dinner when the lights went off. Now, who wants to try? Was cooking. Which tense is this? Probably can we have, okay, we have Chloe here. Yeah? All right, Chloe. Past 
continuous tense. Past continuous tense. Very good, Chloe. Can we give her three stars? Three stars for Chloe. Well done. Many stars, Chloe. Okay, now if you look at the sentence again, went off. Went off. The word went. What tense is it? Okay, we have Jishant. Jishant? Simple past tense. Simple past tense. Excellent, Jishant. He oh, does gets... he get? Does he get three stars as well? Uh, do you think that we should give him three stars? Yes. Yes, we should give him three stars. Three stars. Well done, Jishant. Very yeah. good. Okay, so if you look at this, was cooking is past continuous tense, went of a simple past tense. We shall now move to the exercise. Okay, okay. let's try this. Mm -hmm. Read the text. Choose the correct answer. So, do you have your mini whiteboards with you? Yes. Can you show me your mini yes. whiteboard? Okay, good. All right. right. Now, let's look at the text. I want you to choose the answer. Choose the answer. Okay, let's look at the first one. Rahima completed or was completing her school task last evening when the lights were going or went off. So what do you think the answer is for the first one? Hmm... I think my friends at home as well can also try and guess and later uh, we get to compare our answers yes. as well. Please write them down. Okay, can we have probably Audrey? Audrey, do you want to try? The first, one is, the first one is was completing. The first one is was completing. Excellent, Audrey. It is was completing. Alright? The first one is was completing. Can we have... Uh, okay, Rahima was completing her school task last evening when the lights... Can I have another pupil to answer the question? Hmm, all right. We have uh, Adam raising Adam? his hand. Adam, what do you went. think? Went. You think the answer is went? When the lights yes. went off. Yes. Excellent. So, they deserve three stars. Three stars. So, both Audrey and Adam get three stars? Yes. All right. One, two, and three. Welcome to the Three Star Club. <laughs> well done to you. Very good. Okay, now we move on to the next one. Her brother was playing or played board games with his friend. Hmm... So, can we have... Okay, we have Jayshant again, yeah? Shall we call him? Jayshant, what do you think the answer is? My answer is was playing. Her brother was playing board games with his friend. What do you think, Sean? Um, hmm, I think that is actually correct. Yes, it is. It is correct. Yeah. Bravo. Okay. How many stars will he get? Three. Three well. stars. Well done, Jayshant. Well done. Okay, let's move on to the next one. Her lovely mother was cooking cooked dinner when the electricity went or was going off. We will look at the first part here. Okay, so who is going to give me the answer? Chloe? Yes, Chloe. The answer is... cooking. What is cooking? was cooking. Her lovely mother was cooking dinner. So, do you think the answer is correct, Sean? Hmm... I think it is correct. Excellent. <laughs> well done. How many stars will she get? I think we should only give her two stars. Two stars? Do you think two stars is sufficient, Chloe? <laughs> we should give her three stars, Three Sean. stars, okay. because she did a wonderful job. Well done. Well yeah. done. You're most welcome. Okay, let's look at the sentence again. Her lovely mother was cooking dinner when the electricity 
What is the answer there? Uh, okay, shall we call? Uh, shall we call uh, Jayshant? Mm -hmm. My answer oh. is went off. Your answer is went off. Her lovely mother was cooking dinner when the electricity went off. Jayshant, very good. It is the answer. All right. So I think for this, Jayshan, how many stars shall he get? I think we should only give him one star. One star. Are you happy with the one star, Jayshan? <laughs> <laughs> how many stars do you want? Jayshan, one, two or three? I don't know. You can pick. <laughs> I can pick. <laughs> oh, so he's so honest. <laughs> okay, you know what? He did a really good job. Yes. Shall we give him three stars? Yes, he deserves all the three yes. stars. Yes. Well done to you. <laughs> okay, let's move on to the next one. Good job, pupils. Okay, now the next one. Her poor dad had was having a shower. When the water went or was going ice cold. So let's look at the first one. What do you think the answer is? So, whom shall we choose? Sean, is Chloe or Audrey? I saw Chloe with her hand up for the longest time. Okay. Let's give her a rest and choose her. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Chloe, what is the answer? My answer is was having. Was having. Okay, Chloe, her poor dad was having a shower. Very good. It is the answer. Yay. Yes, that's the answer. Good job. So, three stars again for Chloe. Yes, three stars for you. There are a lot of stars here. Thank you. All right. Most welcome. And the last one. Uh, when the water went or was going ice cold? All right, Adam was pretty swift. Who, Adam? Hand. Yes. Okay, shall we just pick Adam? All right. Adam, what's the answer? Can you show me your mini white box? is wet. Your answer is went. Her poor dad was having a shower when the water went Work. ice cold. Poor dad. Yes, Adam, good job. You got the answer correct. So, three stars again for Adam. Well done, Adam. Bravo. Bravo to you. What an evening it was. Okay, now, pupils, let's look at the answers that you have Chosen. Okay. Okay, let's look at this. Rahima was completing her school task last evening mm -hmm. when the lights went off. Her brother was playing board games with his friend. Right. Her lovely mother was cooking dinner when the electricity went off. And the last two sentences, can anyone read? Okay. Uh, since uh, Jayshant yes. raised his hand first, Jayshant, her poor dad? Her poor dad was having a shower when the water went ice cold. What an evening it was. Very good. So, it looks like all four of you have answered all the, uh, have chosen all the correct answers. So, we have come, uh, these, are, these are the answers that you have chosen and mm -hmm. all your answers are correct. Well done to everyone. You deserve a round of applause. Give yourselves a round of applause. I think you did a fantastic job. But also, I want to also go back to this, to this um, paragraph over here, right? How do we actually identify or why were the answers correct? Could you explain that to us, Miss Anjana? Okay, of course, because I did mention that past continuous tense is an event which continues for a period of time mm -hmm. when the other event occurs. Okay. So, if you look at the first one, Rahima was completing her school task last evening when the lights went off. Okay. So, you need to use uh, past, you have to use this. Past continuous tense mm -hmm. for the first verb and, of course, simple past tense for the second verb. So, that means two things happen at the same time. Yes. And, and of course, one, one continues of it... ah, when, okay. the others, when the other one occurs. Okay, okay, okay. And why is it in past tense? Mm -hmm. Because it happens in the past. I see. Yes. All right. 
Okay, so if maybe if I can give an example to further clarify. For example, if let's say right now, um, we have our friends who are online during the show. So if let's say I were to talk about this tomorrow, this would have already occurred or happened, right? So I can say that uh, my friends were with me learning when when the show happened yesterday. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. Yeah, because I use both uh, the past continuous tense as well as simple past tense. Yes, in a sentence. Ah, all right, all right, all right. That seems interesting. Okay, and I believe everyone have answered or understand so far. Uh, did you guys think you did a good job? Give yourself a thumbs up if you think you did. Double thumbs up. There we go. Of course you did. And that's why all of you deserved three stars earlier by Miss Anjana. But right now, because you did such a wonderful job, we're going to take a short break and be back, for, uh, back to you for Level 2 on Delete TV KPM. You are now watching Level 2 on Didit TV KPM together with me, Sean Steven, and also Miss Anjana. Obviously, we're learning English right now for the topic of our newspaper article. It's an emergency. Let's continue our lesson. Over to you. Yes. Shall we continue? Are you all ready, pupils? And the pupils out there? Are you all ready? Give me a double thumbs up if you're ready. Yes. yes. Great. Right. Let's okay. Let's look at this section. Can you read this, Sean? Okay. Uh, boggle woggle? Pog boggle woggle, yes. Okay. okay, now, can you see this circle here? Okay, yes. So, and we have a lot of alphabets here. Mm. So, the alphabets, you can see E, G, M, Y, N, C, and R. Okay, okay now, pupils out there, please take your mini whiteboards. Okay, show me your mini whiteboards. Okay, Sean, you also have your mini whiteboard, uh, I suppose. Yes, it's kind of not white. <laughs> it's orange. I have a card over here. Okay, now what I want you to do is mm -hmm. build as many words as you can okay. from the alphabets given. All right. Okay, so you have to build words as many as you can mm -hmm. using all the letters given here. Okay. Example, mm -hmm. gem. Ah, so we use the alphabets in the circle and we create our own yes, words. Yes, so okay. I'm going to use the G here, the E here, and the M here. That's one word. Okay, ah, but we can't use this word. No. Okay, no, okay, we'll no. find something else other than that. Okay, it. shall we start now? Okay, start writing as many words as you can. Okay, Sean is also playing the game with you yes. and the pupils out there, you too. Write as many words as you can. So we have G, we have M, we have Y, we have N, we have C, we have R. Okay, so we can see the pupils there. Yes, I already have three words. Great, <laughs> come on, let's see who's the winner. <gasps> oh, yes. Oh, as this is a long word. As many words you can. Adam, put on your thinking caps, Adam. Okay, I have four words so far. Even, even for those of you watching at home, can also give it a try and see how yes. many words you can come up with. I have a few in my hand here. Yeah? Hmm, okay. How much more time do we have? Okay. I think we can give maybe another 30 seconds? Uh, yes, 30 only 30 seconds. seconds. That okay, means 30, 30 seconds. seconds for me too. Okay, so we have uh, probably uh, E, Y, E. Oh? E, Y, E. Hmm. So 
Mm. That's like a word, a clue given to you. Uh -huh. And um, we have like um, we have G E R M. <laughs> Wait, that's okay. my that's my word. <laughs> <laughs> okay, like looks like Audrey has uh, Audrey. Looks like you have a lot of words there. Yeah, they seem to be writing, and I'm already out of idea. How many words you have there? Don't show. Okay, you have five. <laughs> Chloe, are you still writing, Chloe? And the pupils out there, keep thinking, keep writing. Come on. Maybe let's give them 15 seconds. I'll do, I'm going to do a countdown. Yes, you should. And then everyone will show their, their, yes. their, 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 their boards, right? So 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 and a half, 1. <laughs> And time is up. Oh, okay. You can see Chloe raising her hand over there. Okay, hands up, hands up, hands up. Okay. okay. So now, uh, okay, plus Sean. Okay. Could you please show me your mini whiteboards? So how many words you have there? Sean has five. I have five. <laughs> I have five. And I'm proud Jay of these Sean, words. How many words you have there? Wow. Oh, wow! One, two, three, four, five, six. And Adam has three. Good right. try, Adam. Uh, Chloe has... Chloe no has 13. What? <laughs> what? 13? And uh, Audrey has one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Excellent. And uh, Sean, how many words you have? I only have five. 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 So and two of the words you already mentioned at the beginning. <laughs> so I think I only have three. I'm in the same club as Adam. Okay. Can we have... Uh, okay, as you can see there, I think the winner is... I think the winner is Chloe. Yes. Having tw 13 words. That is amazing. Can you read out all the words for us? Chloe? Can are you, you sure those are words? <laughs> Let me see that. Okay. Chloe, could you read the words for us? Man, Jen, my, green. Hiya, Chloe. Can... Okay. I, Mir, Mercy, Gray, Jin, Janir. Excellent. And... Merch, Merch and enemy and enemy. I wow. think uh, Chloe has more words than my than I have here. Okay, how many words do you I have? I have I, mm -hmm. Jen, mm -hmm. Yen, Yen, Cry, Cry, okay, Man, okay, Me, Me, and Germ. Germ. Okay, all right. So the, Chloe mm -hmm. deserves three. Three stars. stars, because this is the maximum number of stars that we have over here. What about the others? How many stars do they get? The others well? deserve also three stars. Three stars as well. Well done to you. Okay, so like all the words that Chloe has mentioned, as well as what Miss An uh, Anjana has mentioned, do you have any other words aside from the words that we have mentioned so far? Or are they all the same or within what we have said? I think it's almost the same. Almost the same, yes. right? Yes. And wow. if you look at all this alphabet here, yeah, Sean, mm -hmm. yes. what do you think this word is? Uh, hey, wait, I think... Okay, wait, we saw someone raise their hand just now. Who, who was that? Jay Sean, yes. Jay Sean, what word is this? Emergency. Excellent. So, yes. Oh, yes. That is right. Very good, Jay Sean. So give him the three stars. Three stars for you. Woohoo! <laughs> All right. All right. Okay. Looks like we have come to the to the end of the lesson. Mm -hmm. Okay. And all four of them have yes. done very well. Ah. Actively participating in all the activities. Yes. Right. So by the end of the lesson, mm -hmm. they have actually read the text. Remember okay. the newspaper article? Yes. Okay. They have answered all the questions correctly mm -hmm. based on the text read. And of course, they have built words from the alphabets given. All of them have 
done all of this. All right. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. And now, what about our friends or my friends who are online right now? How well did they do? What were the how would you rate their performance? I will rate them 10 over 10. 10 over 10. Double awesome. thumbs up. Well done to everyone. Give yourselves a round of applause. And for those of you watching at home right now, if you did the same or if you answered just like how our friends online have answered so far, you also deserve a 10 out of 10. Isn't that right? Yes. That's right. And of course, if let's say, you know, we have done this or maybe some of us at home who are watching this and we are unable to answer as well or if we want extra enhancing exercises, where can we get it from? Of course, you can get them from Sumberku. Please refer ah. to Sumberku for the extra enrichment activities there. All right. Thank you so much, uh, Miss Anjana, for this lovely lesson today. And of course, to my friends who are online today, we got Chloe, we got Jay Shan, we have Audrey okay. as well as Adam. Thank you so much for joining us. And for those of you watching at home as well, hopefully this is beneficial for you. And make sure you continue watching DTV KPM for more lessons like this. And of course, we will see you in our next class. Till then, take care. Thank you. Bye. Oh, bye bye. you know what I found? Bye. I found it. Thank you, Sean. Oh, see Finally, all the I can read my newspaper. I've been looking for <laughs> it. Here you go. Thank you. Bye. So what is it? What's in the newspaper? I think they've... There's yes. an emergency. Oh. So we should be reading the newspaper. Oh, wow. Look at this. Oh, no. Oh my goodness. TV KPM